wanted to put my bushing in for my um, cylinder head or thread repair kit. I'm going to have to put a drop of oil on this, the same as we always do. And then what we're going to do, we're, we're actually physically going to take, again, I turn it by hand, we're physically going to take all the threads out. Because right now, the threads are basically the head thin because you've got a hole drilled right through in the water tank. We're going to draw threads and create a cavity so we can go ahead and cap it. So what I like to do is put a drop of oil in each fluid of the tap uh, when I'm going. And then, of course, what I'm going to do also is when I start, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, when I start my tap, I'm going to turn it in until it gets started. Then I'm going to back it up one quarter turn to clear the thread. You can see a beautiful job our uh, machine shop grade tap did uh, to that hole. And now we're going to head ready it to, to get ready for the insert. We have our insert tool. Uh, I'm going to apply some of our uh, thread locking fluid around it. I'm going to take one bead all the way around it and go ahead and insert it and you'll be able to see how easy that turns in. This insert tool is really nice because what it's gonna do is allow you to stop flush with the uh, cylinder head so you know you're in, you're in deep enough and you're in good shape. Let's see if we're following in. And now you have a beautiful thread repair, cylinder head repair that actually is stronger than the original threads itself. But you can see it took just a few minutes to go ahead and make this repair versus the 10 to 15 hours to take a head off, put a sewer head on it, or send to the machine shop to make a, make a repair. So there you have it. If you have any questions, by all means, check us out at promaxtool.com. Thank you for watching.